In today's video, I walk around the neighborhood in San Salvador after getting lost hiking in the mountains. It was pretty hot this day, uh, but it was nice to walk around this neighborhood. I felt quite safe the whole time, and the people that I spoke with off the camera were very nice. I really enjoy this country a lot, and the people here, they're very friendly. El Salvadorian people are some of the nicest and caring people I have met in my travels. I can't wait to go back in the future. This, co this country is absolutely amazing. In el video de hoy, paseo por un barrio de San Salvador después de perdirme haciendo senderismo en las montañas. Este día sí hacía calor y fue agradable pasar por este barrio. Me sentí bastante seguro todo el tiempo y la gente con la que hablé afuera de cámara fui muy amable. Me gusta mucho este país y la gente es muy amable. Los salvadoreños son algunos de las personas más amables y atentas que he conocido en mis viajes. Estoy deseando volver en el futuro otra vez. I think I'm gonna have to take a long one. Continue on to Calle Arturo and Brogi. I'm gonna have to take a longer way. I don't know if some of these roads are available to the public. <coughs> yeah, I'm good now. It's making me take a different route. That was pretty cool. It's not too hot. It's humid, but it's not too hot. There's some pretty nice houses out here. I think I was supposed to come down that way, but it was blocked off for me. It's okay though. say this country is really dangerous but uh, for granted you know there are some dangerous parts but I'm nowhere close to them but I felt pretty safe here my whole time been here for four days when I started this when I started this everyone's really nice I suggest that you visit any country you learn how to speak the language. I'm not 100% fluent in Spanish, but I can get by and I can have a communication. I can have a good, you know, conversation. Um, but, yeah, it's always good to learn the language. Been to numerous amounts of countries, at least for the basics. And the people will respect you and you'll get good treatment. Because, you know, I'm not from this country. My grandparents are not from this country. My grandparents are from Mexico. Cool out here. I'm gonna drink my bag of water pretty soon. I don't know what I'm gonna do next. I don't know if I'm gonna go back to the beach or what's gonna happen next. I'm gonna do something. I actually might take a walk. Walk to the beach and then walk back. Well, actually, I don't know. It's like about 13 miles out. We'll see what I do. I might take. Uh, I might take a taxi back, but I'm nowhere close to the beach right now.
different from the United States. There's no bus stops. There's bus routes, but there's no bus stops. You gotta, you gotta flag down the bus. Then you're trying to get off the bus. You gotta flag the bus to stop. That was pretty cool. I think I'm almost where I need to be at. Yeah, I'm almost there. Once I make a left, I'm gonna start hitting close. Not the city, but you know the outskirts of the city. And then I'm gonna take a taxi. So. I'm gonna put my mask on. The police are starting to enforce it again out here. So. And every restaurant I've gone to, I've tipped them a little bit extra because it's too cheap here, man. I feel like a piece of shit not doing it for how much money I'm making. 